Okay, so um, you've obviously seen us vlogging about the Anchia electric bikes, but obviously <laughs> we need to transport these bikes around. So we have bought a um, bike rack that goes on the back of the car. There it is. I just wanted to let you see that in situ with the two electric bikes on. Now, you have to be really careful when buying a bike rack for electric bikes because they are heavier than your normal bike. Um, so you need to make sure that the rack you're buying will take your one or your two electric bikes and they can take that extra load. You can buy bike racks for about 40, 50, 60 quid upwards, but we had to spend a bit more on this one because again, we've got the electric bikes and it needs to take that extra weight. So this is the rack we've got. It's called Pure Instinct. It's a rear bike carrier and it's by a company called Peruzzo, P-E-R-U-Z-Z-O, which is an Italian company. And we bought it from an Italian dealer called Lord Gun. Now the good thing about this was we ordered it on the Sunday and it was delivered to us on the Wednesday. So even though it was coming from Italy, the delivery was really, really good. So 10 out of 10 for Lord Gun would really recommend them. Um, I'm going to turn the box over just so you can see some of the features that we've got on this bike rack. Okay, so here's the rear of the, the box and I just want to show you what we've got on here. So here's all the information with regards to the bike rack carrier. It carries two to three bikes or two e-bikes. Well, as you saw, we've got two e-bikes on there. Um, fits most saloons, estates, hatchback vans. We've got a Kia Sportage and uh, it fits no problems. Six straps, tested to 300 kilos for extra safety. Fully assembled, it literally does. Comes fully assembled and uh, you just take it out of the box and put the straps on and off you go. So you've got steel tubes with anti-rust. Can't give you any uh, queries on that one at the moment because we've only just put it on. Quick and easy to fit and remove. Um, well, it took us about an hour, so I wouldn't say quick, but I think it will be easier the second time round. Carries bikes on 12 to 29 inch frames. Uh, we've got 26 and a 20 on here. Folds flat for storage, and it does. There you go, there's a picture there, if you have a look. It folds flat and goes into the back of a car. So really, really good. And then what else have we got? Um, you've got extra oversized wheel supports. So you've got some extra supports that go on the wheels. Um, so you can actually uh, get the larger bikes on there. Folds up to save space. Um, supplies with grab arms for two and three bikes, absolutely. And double safe with extra strap fixed to the frame. Um, so that is, uh, that really is good. So there you go, that's the features on it. Um, there's a few other things that come with it. You've got the crocodile clip there that holds the bikes on. And if I just take you to the bike rack, you can see that crocodile clip sitting there on the frame that's holding the second frame in place. You've got a really good strap here that has got a ratchet that brings it round, keeps it firm. You've got the straps with ratchets that come around the wheels there. And that's on every wheel, as you can see, coming through. And then you've got fixings that come underneath the bottom and the fixings that come up to the top. We've just been out for a, a trial run in this and this rack and these bikes did not go anywhere. So there you go. I'm going to take the bikes off that rack now so you can actually have a look at the rack without the bikes on. So there you go. There is the rack without the bikes on it. So you can see how it sits on the car. So it's pretty good. You can then fold these in. They keep everything nice and tidy. Okay, these are the two extensions that they offer you that they clip on and off. So if you've got a wider wheel, you can actually extend that longer. And they just snap on and snap off. 
So when you're putting it away, you can actually take and remove those. Um, all in all, a really good, strong, sturdy bike rack. Um, not a lot more I can say, really. Um, cost us about 160 quid. So again, well, 150, 160 quid, not cheap. But if you're looking for that extra weight because you are carrying e-bikes, then you will need to do it. Another tip which they say is take the batteries out of your e-bikes before you're loading them. Obviously that makes them a little lighter, as I have done on there. And that's it. That's the boy there. So it's the Peruzzo, P-E-R-U-Z-Z-O. Comes from Italy. We bought it from Lord Gun. Um, there's the bike rack and would really recommend it well i hope you found that video of interest if you have please 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 give us a thumbs up we'd really really appreciate it hit that red button and subscribe the more you subscribe then the more we can bring you on these videos um, and really appreciate you watching look forward to meeting you all again soon thanks very much and bye for now